I was just having a call with my accountability partner, Niels, and I was telling him how this morning I don't even want my... <laughs> I don't even want to set my intention for the day. I'm going out for lunch and then afterwards I'm going to meet a friend. And I can already tell today that I don't, again, just like yesterday, I don't really want to work out. I don't know if I want to practice the flute, so we'll see. It is almost 10 p.m. right now, so I want to make this really quickly and go to bed as quickly as possible. So let's get to the review. I had a nice lunch celebrating someone's birthday. And during lunch, I got a comment saying that my skin is noticeably worse. It's difficult to see in the camera with this lighting right now, but just looking at the mirror, yeah, it doesn't look very good up close. And that's because I've been going on daily walks since July, so that's, that's five months now I've been walking on an almost daily basis with no sunscreen. Even though the walks are in the morning, I guess the sun is doing damage to my skin, so... I was told I should use sunscreen every single day. Bit of a hassle that I have to wash it off every single night. I've just been using a cl clarifying lotion to wipe my skin at night before sleeping, but now I'm gonna have to do a full-on wash every night. Bit of a hassle, but I guess it'll be worth it. And then I met my friend and we went for a walk. So including my morning walk and walking with my friend, I got over 18,000 steps today. And we talked about a lot of things, but one of the things he said was that if I eat two chicken breasts every single day and keep working out the way that I'm wor working out, I will see pretty massive gains. So maybe I should give it a try. He also introduced me to cottage cheese. I tried a bite. It was pretty good. He said it's a great source of protein. So I think I'm going to buy some cottage cheese the next time I get a chance. And then I got home and then I had a phone call with a friend and he was telling me how he went to a high school reunion and it wasn't a good time for him because he kept comparing him his life to other people, right? As one does in these things, just seeing how people turned out after many years later. One guy was a standout because he got rich through Bitcoin and he bought his parents a house and bought himself a house and bought part of this restaurant or bar that they were at hosting the venue. And even other people who were also in computer science like my friend but had jobs for a while or earning over a hundred thousand a year and then he said a girl a cute girl a few years younger than him came over and wanted to sit and drink with him so they were talking and then she asked what does he do and he said phd student and then she went silent for a few seconds and then pretty soon after that she just left so he felt rejected and bad about that too so i told him well i i told him it probably is isn't a good idea to go in the first place. But now that he went, I told him, stop comparing yourself to other people. And I guess focus on Jordan Peterson thing. Compare yourself to who you were yesterday, not who someone else is today. So he said, maybe I should focus on looking forward to my Japan trip. And I said, yeah, definitely look forward to that. You're already looking forward to it. Focus on that. So that's how I spent my day. I did not work out or play the flute, but I had a good time hanging out with my friend and then talking to the other friend, kind of. He even called me. It feels like I'm talking to a shrink. <laughs> I guess I was playing the role of a shrink, but I understand how he feels because I've also been in his shoes, so being an empathetic shrink who also went through the same experiences as you, or similar. So got my steps in and had a good chat with a couple friends. Pretty good day. I am picking my dad up from the airport tomorrow. I hope I can keep on track because the last time he came over, I just kind of dropped a lot of things and it completely ruined my routine or I let it fall apart. So this time I still want to keep my daily habits going, but at the same time I also want to spend a lot of time with him, so we'll see. 1% better every day, baby.